Hello everyone, welcome to Hacker Keep. In this video, we will look into solving the problem validate IP address. It is a medium problem, but it's pretty straightforward problem. Before we start, please do like and subscribe to the channel Hacker Keep. Let's look into this. Given a string, we need to determine if it's an IPv4 or an IPv6. So let's look into the characteristics of IPv4 or IPv6. So for IPv4, if you look into this, there will be four segments for IPv4. So the total segments will be four and these are separated by dot and for IPv6, these are separated by colon and there are eight segments. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So eight segments, we need to check those. And the maximum IP is 255.255.255.255. The segment shouldn't be greater than 255, 255. And the values for the segment should be between the each character should be between zero and nine that is one check we need to do and we also need to check there are no trailing or prefix dots similarly in ipv6 what we will check is uh, the length of each segment should be between zero to four and the character in each segment should be between zero to nine or a to small f or capital a to capital f that's all we need to check. If all these checks are passed, we would return either IPv6 or IPv4. If none of them passed, we would just return neither. Let's go ahead and code this out. So the first thing we need to check is if the given IP is equal to null or IP dot length is equal to zero, we would just return neither. Now we need to check if IP dot contains of dot we need to check for check ip before of ip else if ip dot contains of colon we would just return check ip v6 of ip all right if none of them we would just return neither now we need to define these functions link string check ipv4 of string ip let me copy this and save few seconds v6 so we talked about it we need to check for ipv4 there are no trailing dots if ip dot caret of zero is equal to dot or ip dot caret of uh, dot length minus one equal to dot return I'll go ahead and define a string so that I don't have to write neither all the time. Neither. Return n. Now that is done, we will divide this IP into segments. String array segments is equal to IP dot split of dot. Now we will check. The number of segments should be four. If not, we will just return neither. If segments dot is equal to, not equal to four, we will just return n. That's it. Now for each segment, what we need to check is. We need to check the segment length should be between 0 and 3 and if there is a starting character starts with 0 the length of the segment should be 1. We will check that condition if segment dot length is equal to 0 or segment dot length greater than 3 or segment dot carrot of zero is equal to zero and segment dot 
length greater than one just written n now we check that for each character in the segment we need to check it's between zero and nine so int i is equal to zero i less than segment dot length i plus plus what we need to check is if segment dot caret of i less than zero or segment dot caret of i greater than nine just written n now we will check the integer value of the string should it be greater than 255 integer dot value of segment greater than 255 return n if everything looks good we would just return ip v4 now coming to the ipv6 we will check we will define the n is neither if ip dot let me copy this and see a few seconds here we will be looking for colon and not a dot we will just return n really we will split into segments ip dot split off colon i will check if segments dot length not equal to 8 for ipv6 it should be 8 I'll just return n now for each segment we need to check if segment dot length Equal to zero or segment dot greater than four in IPv6 each segment is of length four. We just written none. That is good. For we need to check the each character. And I zero I less than segment dot plus plus I will define a character so is equal to segment dot character of i now we need to check if it's between 0 to 9 a to f capital to capital f not of c is greater than or equal to 0 and c is then or equal to 9 and let me copy this I need to check if it's between a to f and capital A to capital F and just written and if everything is good we will return IP V6 all right let's go ahead and submit hmm care cannot be converted into care sequence oh this is string dot always something right bunch of typos sorry about that all right here we go i hope it's clear all we are checking for uh, if it contains dot we will check for ipv4 if it contains a colon we will check for ipv6 in ipv4 we will check there are four segments and each segment length is between 0 to 3 and the characters are between 0 to 9 for ipv6 we will check there are eight segments if 
the length of the character uh, segment is between 0 to 4 and for each character is between 0 to 9 a to small smaller to small f and capital a to capital f that's all we are doing so i hope it's clear please do like and subscribe to the channel hacker thank you for watching